Welcome to the video, today I'm going to show you how you can record your PS4 screen on your computer for free and you can get this set up within a couple of minutes. So the first thing we want to do is go onto our PS4 and we want to go to the settings menu. Once here you want to scroll all the way down and then you want to find where it says remote play connection settings. Then you want to make sure enable remote play is on. Once you've done this you then want to go ahead and jump on your computer you want to record your PS4 from. So once you hit your computer you want to go ahead and load your web browser and you want to download two applications. The links will be in the description to both of them. So the first one is called PS4 Remote Play, you can either download it for Windows or Mac and this is basically going to stream your PS4 onto your computer and you can actually control it on your computer as well which is really handy. And the second application is going to be Streamlabs OBS which is what you're going to use to record that stream. Again you can download it for Windows or Mac and this is basically like uh, the normal OBS but Streamlabs you can do so much more as it says here. So again just click on the link in the description and you can download both these applications. Okay, so once we've got both applications installed, you want to go ahead and load up the PS4 Remote Play application and you want to make sure that your PS4 is already turned on and it's ready to go. So once the application is loaded up, you want to go ahead and click on Settings and you want to sign into your PlayStation Network. Now for me it's done it automatically because I've used it before, but for you you'll have to manually sign in. And then where it says Resolution, you want to go ahead and click the highest resolution your PS4 supports. Now in this case I can only go up to 720p because I'm using the standard PS4. Only PS4 Pros can go up to 1080p because the CPU is powerful enough to do that. So all I'm going to do is go ahead and click on the 720p option because that's all I can use. And you want to make sure your frame rate is on high for the highest quality. And make sure your use keyboard is ticked for the best convenience. Obviously you don't have to have it on. Then you want to go ahead and click on OK. And then you want to go ahead and click on Start. Now, as you can see, my PS4 is now streaming from a computer with the application. And if you want to go ahead and control it, you can use your keyboard and mouse to do this. Or if you want to use a PS4 remote, which I assume you want to do that, you'll have to make sure it's connected to your computer with a wire, otherwise it won't work. So now we've got our PS4 screen all set up, we want to go ahead and minimize the application. And then you want to go ahead and open up Streamlabs OBS. Now this is what it's going to look like, and it does look a bit trippy because I'm currently using it to record. Uh, but basically you want to get the scene set up so it's recording desktop like mine. So all we need to do is go ahead and click this big plus button and make a new scene. You can call it whatever you want. And then once your new scene is created like this has, um, you want to go ahead and create a source. Again, just do the same thing, click on the plus button. And you want to make sure you click on display capture and then click on add source. And that's basically going to record a certain display. So it's recording on a monitor, for example. So once you've got it set up like mine has here, um, you then want to go ahead and load up the PS4 application, so as you can see it's recording it. So I'm going to remove the Streamlabs uh, application out of the way, so it looks better. Then you want to make sure this is in full screen. So then when you load up your Streamlabs OBS, as you can see the application is in full screen, just as it was in the start of the video. Then you want to go ahead and click on record. So when you start recording your PS4 screen, it's going to look like you're actually recording directly from your PS4 and not on your computer. Now I'm not going to go through all the Streamlabs settings because this video is going to take way longer. But if you want to do that, just go ahead and search on YouTube how to set up Streamlabs OBS and there will be a video to do that. Now if you are a bit concerned about quality, this is heavily dependent on your Wi-Fi connection or your LAN connection. So if you want the very best quality, you want to make sure you have a wired connection to your internet. That way it's going to make the quality better and it's going to be less delay. So if this video is helpful, please leave a like and pass it on to someone who may find it helpful as well. If you have any questions or comments, just leave them below and I'll reply to you as soon as possible. So thank you so much for watching and have a good day.